Welcome to I Am Global Channel. This is Apostle Praise. I'm coming now with part two of uh, the message dealing with the chameleon spirits. And this message is relevant for January 2022 as we begin the year 2022. Because every beginning determines the end. So you don't need to move through 2022 with the chameleon spirit you need to destroy this spirit from all your relationships and in this message then we're going to be dealing with how to destroy this spirit in part one of this message we were dealing with the types of relationships that are usually attacked by the chameleon spirits all right so if you have not heard of this message a uh, part one of this message it is here Check it from the playlist of this channel and you'll get it before you can come then to part two because part two is a continuation. Now we are moving then to what are the features of the spirit, all right? How does it manifest and how we can overcome the spirit, the chameleon spirit? And then first I need then to get to where does the spirit live, all right? This is the spirit that is found in branches. It is a spirit that dwells in threes, all right? So as the Bible says then, uh, so this spirit knows what to attack, all right? It's very strategic. It's a spirit that is so wise. So it attacks the branches. And who are the branches? The Bible says in the book of John, chapter 15, verse 5 to 6, where Jesus Christ then was giving the sermon to his disciples. And this is the last sermon, all right, before the last supper that Jesus Christ gave. He said that, I am the vine, and you are the branches. He that abided in me, and I in him, the same bringeth forth much fruit. For without me, you can do nothing. If a man abided not in me, he is cast forth as a branch and he is withered and men gather them and cast them into the fire and they are burned. So this spirit is a spirit that Satan is using during the end times because the Satan's, Satan's plan is to make us to go into hates with him because hates were not designed for, for mankind, all right? So Satan is after the branches and it is clear here that Jesus Christ says that I am the vine and you are the branches and who are the branches are the branches that are attached to the to the true vine and these are the born again these are the saints these are the ones who call Jesus Christ my savior all right so this spirit attacks people of God it attacks the branches and when Jesus Christ was given this sermon, it was all about the fruitfulness, all right? So I was saying that if you are attached to me, you will bear fruit, all right? Fruit that is according to the plan of God. Fruit that is according to your destiny, all right? So these, these spirits then, the chameleon spirit, are therefore then there to make you to be barren. All right, they attack the branches to make them barren. So that is why you find that I am planting the seed. I am, I am, I am, I am serving the Lord. All right, I am giving my tithe. All right, spending my time with the Lord. But there is something that is draining my finances, is draining my finances. There might be the chameleon spirit in your life, all right? And this chameleon spirit, it might manifest as an agent of Satan coming to the house of the Lord so as to drain the pockets of people of God who are there. And, 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 and the chameleon saint, all right, inverted commas, because he's a chameleon agent, 
that has come. It, is, it has been sent by Satan, all right, in the house of the Lord. I mean, it's difficult to detect that person because he screams Jesus, sings your songs, and is somebody who, 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 uh, who pretends as loving Jesus Christ, all right, whereas he knows that the allegiance is with Satan is not with Jesus Christ, is, is not born again at all, but will be pretending as, as a born again, all right, is the person then who shines in the church, all right, arrives early and leaves last, all right, always available to do the work of the Lord. Those are Satan plants, all right, plants with the chameleon agents at our churches. So, as servants of the Lord, we need to be careful of them. We need to do prayers that are driving away the chameleon spirit from the house of the Lord. And the reason why we should be doing those prayers is because you have the dominion, all right? So, the Lord is waiting for you to exercise your dominion on earth because as, 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 as we have heard in part one, that these are the creeping spirit that creepeth on earth. And this is, as it is written in the book of, um, in the book of Leviticus, chapter 11, verse 29 to 30, it says that, that these also shall be unclean unto you among the creeping things that creep upon the earth. The, the weasel, the mouse, and the tortoise of his kind, and the ferret, and the chameleon, and the lizard, and the snail, and the mole. So these are the creeping spirit that the Lord says in the book of Genesis chapter 1 verse 26 that he has given us dominion over the creeping things that creeped on earth. So we have dominion over these spirits, all right? And the Bible also says that the Lord gave us the keys of the kingdom, of his kingdom, that whatsoever we bind on earth shall be bound in heaven. Whatsoever we loose on earth shall be loosed in heaven. So the Lord then is waiting upon us, all right, to agree with him against the chameleon spirit that had flooded his house, all right? So with this message, the Lord is saying that, wake up, wake up, pastor. Your church might be flooded by the chameleon spirit. You need to do the prayers that will be uprooting, uprooting the chameleon spirit from your ground in the name of Jesus, all right? So let's move on then with this, with this message. So these are the spirits then that are, that are manifesting during the end times because they are against the branches and we are the branches, all right? So the next thing then that I'm um, going to be dealing with, and, and the reason that they are taking the, 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 the branches is because they want people of God not to bear fruits, all right? They want people of God to experience lack, all right? So you need to uproot the spirit of the chameleons from your finances in the name of Jesus, all right? From the storehouse of the church in the name of Jesus, from your storehouses in the name of Jesus, all right? Because you have a storehouse as well, all right? All right, so now, now I'm going to be dealing with the second thing, all right, that we need second feature that we need to be careful about when we deal with the chameleon spirit. The chameleons are mysteriously attractive. If you look at the skin of the chameleon, it's different colors that are brown, that are bright colors, all right? So then your eye then gets attracted to the person who carries the chameleon spirit. All right, so they have the, the, the agents of Satan that come with the chameleon spirit. They present the qualities that you desire, the, the qualities that you yearn for, all right? The qualities that you as a pastor would think that I need this, you know, to be close to me. So with their 
attractive ways, all right, of the charming spirit that they carry. They want you to be drawn to them, all right? So they appear to be so resourceful, so helpful, all right? Because they understand that as, as the servants of the Lord, we need help. All right, so these are the spirits that are all, always the agents that are carrying the spirits, always willing to assist. So as people of God, we need to be very careful of these spirits, all right? So they, 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 they have come to win your love, all right? So when you look then at the, at the agent of Satan that is coming with the chameleon spirit, you look at somebody that you 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 need all right somebody that you love so so the chameleon people who the chameleon agents uh they want to be loved they want to win love all right so we need to be careful all right these are the agents when they come to the to your church they sit at the back seat all right and study the environment and and check what is it that you need all right where are the gaps here in this church all right where do i need to to feature in this church all right so they they present the qualities in the areas of the needs of the church we need to be very careful and these are the spirits then that will find that they want to be close then to the senior pastor they want to be close to the leadership and even entering the leadership all right these are the spirits that you will find in the burnt you will find in the worship team you will find in the children's ministry, in the evangelism ministry, all right? You will find them in the prophetic ministry. You will find them in the prayer and the intercession ministry. You will find them in fellowships because these are the spirits that go into relationships that are close, all right? And their goal is to divide and destroy. We need to be careful of these spirits and drive them out as we begin 2022 no chameleon agent should be in the house of the lord in the mighty name of jesus let the light of god expose them in jesus name because the lord says that in 2022 he's releasing his light and if you have not had any message about the prophecy of god for 2022 check it in our playlist god says that is releasing light in 2022 so the chameleon agents must be exposed in the mighty name of jesus and leave our churches these are the agents that come then and then pretend as if they are coming to compliment you as a pastor, all right, and to balance your, your spiritual life, all right, and they are not there for that. They are great pretenders, all right. They are the spirits that they've come to suck your spiritual life, all right, suck your vigor in the things of the Lord, all right, and drain your spiritual your spiritual gift and bring them down into the dust they are the spirits that have come to quench then the, the 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 light of god from the house of the lord quench this the the fire from the altar all right and also to to drain and dry up the anointing of the Holy Spirit. They are the spirits that are there to make them the spiritual gifts to come down. You must be careful about these spirits. And they are there to steal the finances of the church, to steal the finances of the servants of the Lord and the people who are fellowshipping in this church. So we need them to come against, to join hands, yeah? 
need to join hands as a pastor teach about the, the chameleon spirit in your church stand at the pulpit and let the people to be aware of the spirit so that you join hands and the gang against it and chase it out of the church in the name of jesus now let's get to the other feature now of the spirit all right it is the spirit now that then it, it it's it has the ability to change the skin color either for self gain all right protection or for deception all right so and for other for other means all right so this spirit then it changes its color skin it has that ability and the reason for that is it, it pretends to be what you want it to be these are the spirits that pretend to be god i am when they get into the house of the lord because god says that i am all right this is what he said to moses that when the people are asking you as to who have sent you say that it is god that i am all right that i am all right so these are the spirits then that pretend to be anything that you want them to be so they are able so a, a, a chameleon agent it, it comes with with the spiritual abilities all right they call the demons that will be helping them to 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 excel in whatever ministry that they get to you will find them that these these are the this they use the, the the spirit of jezebel to prophesy because there's a thin line between the chameleon spirit and and the jezebel actually they work together so they come and prophesy they come and do a, 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 and teach because jezebel the bible says that jezebel was a teacher all right so so jezebel also manifests in the churches as the teacher all right as the prophet so these are the spirits then they come and they are teaching and all that and and you'll be wondering as to how they are doing this because this person is not born again all right is the chameleon agent i i i i, I heard one time from an ex-marine agent was telling me this that when they come to the house of the lord because uh, her assignment was to attack churches and bring them down all right so then she says that as i stand and and was a, was an was an ex a marine agent who was sent by satan to be a pastor all right so she, he says that he had this church all right that he established and he says that this is the church that was established by the marine all right so says that I was not born again. I knew nothing about the word. I was not reading the word of God. But then, as I am speaking, standing at the pulpit, I will come up with fake tongues. And these fake tongues, then I'm calling the spirits of the marine to come and release a scream before me and people will not be able to see this screen and in this screen that's where then the word the scriptures are written that are relevant to what i'm saying so as i am preaching i'm quoting scriptures verbatim and the people will be saying that amen oh my pastor knows the word oh so he said that how can i read the word of god because this word is an enemy to us it releases light remember what the bible says that it says that the word of the lord is the lamp unto my feet and the light unto my path so the word of the lord releases light so he was the agent of darkness they say that we don't read the word so then but the the spirits that are in the marine i will call them using the fake tongues all right those are the incantations and then the scriptures will come on the screen and and i'm reading the screen as i am quoting the scriptures all right to deceive people so there are also then the chameleon pastors that are behind the pulpits all right chameleon prophets that are behind the pulpits so in 2022 be set free from the chameleon spirit make prayers that will be driving away the spirits in the name of jesus so they change then 
there as he's standing behind the pulpit is the agent of darkness but will change the color all right and become and 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 pretend to be the child of light all right that is what they do so they can pretend to be anything go and be the teachers all right in the children's ministry because as pastors you need to know that satan is targeting children so witches they want to go to the children's ministry all right that is the ministry that we need to pray so hard for for the protection because satan in the end time is targeting the children's ministry so we need to be so careful so these are the these are the, the 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 chameleon agents in the house of the lord are very adaptable all right they are the great actors and deceivers so you need to be very 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 careful they are the double crossers all right the 10 coats so they come in then uh, they are the they are the walls in the ship in the ship skin all right so as to deceive people we need to be very careful all right so a chameleon agent may come and say that I want to join the worship team and this person cannot sing but when he joins when he sings they starts with the tongues and call them the spirits all right the spirits that can sing and 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 sing and worship because what Satan was also worshiping God Satan is good, he's a great musician, all right? There might be the chameleon agent also in your band as a pastor. So you need to drive away all these spirits in the name of Jesus because they are great pretenders. They are very adaptable, all right? So now let's get then to the other feature of the spirit, all right? So a chameleon can move its eyes independently of each other. It can have a 360 degree view of the environment. So the chameleon spirit then is a monitoring spirit, is a detective spirit, all right? Is the spirit that has come then to investigate everything that is happening here, all right? In the house of the Lord, all right? so. You need then then to to understand how they operate. All right, so these are the these are the monitoring spirits with a three hundred and sixty degree view of your life. All right, they can study your life as a, as a pastor and know everything about you. All right, they are monitoring you at your house. They are monitoring you at the church. They are monitoring you every step that you are taking, all right, because they are able to see, they penetrate, they are investigating everything. So as they are here, they are investigating your weaknesses, they are investigating your strengths, and so on, all right? And also then the strengths and the weaknesses of the people who are here in the house of the Lord is on. You need to understand them in the name of Jesus and 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 blind their eyes in Jesus' name because they are sheer you are right to pro, to protrude into every facet of the life of the house of the Lord, including the people who are in the house. So we need to be very careful about these spirits, all right? And the other thing that we need to be careful of them, the other feature that is distinctive of the chameleon spirit is that they have a long tail all right a chameleon has got a long tail and this is a coiling tail all right it it, it coils around the branch all right and who is the branch we are the branches so this spirit coils all around its target to ensure that the target is fully dependent on it all right so these spirits are the are they the chameleon agents when they come into your environment you will think that you don't need any other person because when you are calling for this they are already there 
Remember that they can change the colors. They can be whatever that you want them to be, all right? Whatever ability that you need at that particular time. So when you are saying that, I need this, they are able to come, all right? They are specializing in that. And you are like, they are also specializing. They are jacks of all trade. Be careful of the chameleon agents that invade the house of the Lord because they are after the branches, all right? And so they, they, they coil their tail all around to entrap the branch and say that you are going nowhere. You are going nowhere. These, and the reason that they are coiling you with the tail, it is because their assignment is to bring you backwardness. So they call you with their, with their tail. The tail is, is, is in the behind, all right? It represents backwardness. So you will always be behind, behind them, all right? So bring you that regression in your life coiling you with a tail careful of the spirits but jesus christ is far greater by the time that your eyes are open you are like wow this agent has caused a lot of damage in the church there was one pastor who was sharing one time all right and his experience in his church so he said that there was this woman this woman was in, was leading the intercession this woman was also then a uh, responsible for for the worship team and was also responsible for a number of things all right serving the holy communion and so on everywhere and they were relying on her and she was the chameleon agent. By the time that their eyes were open, the church was in chaos because of this woman. All right? So we need to be very careful then of these because they are the extreme manipulative pretenders. And they are there to bring us backwardness. All right? So now let's get them to the tongue, which is the other feature of this spirit, all right? This spirit has got, has got a very long tongue, all right? It is long and the sticky tongue is a projectile tongue, all right? And it is intended to crutch and to suck the, the, the target from a distance, all right? So as it is in your environment, all right, because it comes close to you, but your eye will catch the chameleon agent from a distance, all right? So it is able to attract you from a distance, suck you from a distance. That's the assignment of the spirit, all right? And the reason for that, it comes then with all its different colors, its different abilities that I can do this, I can do this, and I'm committed, I'm available, and all of that. Look at my willingness to assist. Look at what I love, this Jesus, and so on. Whereas they don't love Jesus at all because they don't have any allegiance with Christ, all right? So we need to be aware of the spirit, all right? So it is a spirit then that uses the tongue to destroy, all right? So it is the spirit that will spread, then spread lies about you. And these lies, they will look like you, all right? So, and, 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 and it, 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 it's the spirit that, that causes that confusion and chaos and divisions. Remember what the, the power of life and death is in the tongue. So they use then the power of the tongue to kill in the house of the Lord, to kill your image as a pastor, to kill your image as a leader in the church, all right? To kill the assignment of the Lord in your life, 
all right your destiny because they are the destiny killers all right they are the they are the destiny aborters all right they will lead the the target to abort the destiny so as they are coming there they are using all these lies they can come to you and release a prophecy that is a lie so that you move away then from the path that the Lord has set you you know on and make you to believe something else that is so false and there is no prophecy that comes from satan that can manifest all right because it's a lie so they come then and take out the truth and replace it with lies in the house of the lord so they are there then to 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 flood and and and, and make people make the house of the lord to be led by lies those are the chameleon spirit because they are so deceptive so look at what the bible says all right in the book of proverbs chapter 6 so from verse 16 to 17 the lord says that these six things doth the lord hate he said that ye seven are an abomination unto him he said that the proud look a lying tongue in the hands that shed the innocent the innocent blood so as you are praying you can use the scripture against these liars because this is this is this is this is the this is the this is the character of the spirit is a lying spirit its tongue its tongue can reach the reason that it is long it is also that it can it can spread lies to go far beyond its environment all right it is good at spreading the lies all right it can use the social media to spread the lies and ensure that they get to places that are that are that are far all right so this is the assignment of the spirit all right it is a spirit that brings gossips with its with this with its tongue all right so as to cause divisions in the house of the lord and you listen to what the bible says here through paul in the book of romans chapter 17 paul here is warning us as people of God, not to entertain gossipers. And he says that now I beseech you, you brethren, mark them which cause divisions and offenses contrary to the doctrine which you have learned and avoid them. Say that, avoid them. So as a child of God, avoid gossipers in the house of the Lord because their assignment is to divide because the person who's coming to you to gossip greater the possibilities that is gossiping about you to others and that person a gossiper is carrying the chameleon spirit and the chameleon spirit is bringing you gossips to gossip about you as well all right so we must be careful of the chameleon spirit in the house of the Lord and they are long times all right to release them the gossip to 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 far reaching places all right they also come to the house of the lord using their tongue to scatter the sheep all right and the divine helpers from 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 your life so many of the people whom God has planted in this church have left and the reason that they have left is because of the lies of the chameleon agents because the chameleon angels when they come to the house of the Lord they are there to scatter all those who are fruitful in the house of the Lord when they see that your prayer life now is rising up they scatter you all right they release lies they will say things that the pastor has not done or say about you all right so we need to be careful it is high time in 2022 that any person who's bringing you the gossip you say that all right you are saying you say that so and so said what about me all right okay and then you take that person to that person all right and say that so and so says this to me that you have said this about me and see if you cannot destroy 
the chameleon gossips around the church because there's power in the tongue, all right? So let's come now to the other feature of the chameleon spirit to see how it manifests in our lives. A chameleon moves slowly, all right? So now when it comes into your life, when it attacks the house of the Lord, it causes delay. It is there to ensure that there is stagnation. Things that could be done very fast, they take ages to be achieved. Or some of them, they get aborted before they are achieved, all right? And the reason it is because it is a spirit that is there to steal the fruits, all right? As I said in part one, that is a spirit that attacks production. It attacks the works of the hands. It attacks the fruits because it's the spirit that is attacking the branches. And fruits come from the branches, all right? So they attack that progress in the life in your life and also in the life of the house of the lord so we need then to understand it so, so these are the spirits that are the time wasters all right they would bring wasters in the in the house of the lord so the house of the lord will move away from the vision all right and will focus now on entertainments and 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 ensure that then the time is not spent on prayer is is spent mostly on entertainment so it causes that diversion, all right, and steals the time for the things of the Lord. So as to bring the things of the world into the house of the Lord, we need to be careful. The Lord said that we must pray without ceasing, all right. So now if you go to the house of the Lord and say to people now, let's pray. So you will find that if some, they look at, the, at their watches, they want to leave. People are lazy to pray. The reason that they are lazy to pray, they might be the chameleon agents in the house that are there to drain the, the interest in prayer, all right? To bring the prayer lives down of the people who are in the house of the Lord. So we need to be careful of these agents, all right? They dry up their prayer lives. They dry up our spiritual lives, all right? So as to make us not to be interested in the things of the Lord, but in the things of this world, all right? So we need then to be careful. As a pastor, check how much time is spent in the things of the Lord and in the things. And I don't even think that we should be having entertainment in the church, all right? And focus so much on it. If people want entertainment in, your, in the house of, they must go to the clubs. Because the church is not a club. It's not a club. Why are we bringing the world into the house of the Lord? Because the house of the Lord is, is filled with people who are living in this world but are not of this world. All right? So why are we bringing darkness in the house of the Lord to create now this 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 zebra all right because because the bible says that then there is no relationship between light and darkness and it says that darkness cannot comprehend light so we need to understand all these things and 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 stop being the pleasers of people as pastors and and go straight and do what the word says that we should be doing is the end times all right so we should not be wasting time on things that are irrelevant especially of the lord all right so let's remove the time wasters in 2022 all right so then now the other feature that we need to check which is very salient and distinctive of these spirits all right and the the, the chameleons they can rapidly replicate and cover all the areas of your life these the chameleons they can can give birth up to 100 children at the goal so when you have the chameleon, when an agent of Satan comes, the chameleon agent comes in your church, it, it can spread that spirit, spread that demons, all right? 
to, to many people and give birth to many children in the house of the Lord. And by the time that you look, then people are all gossiping, are fighting one another. There's too much division in the church, all right? There's a spirit of sexual immorality in the church. There are lies in the church, all right? And it is because of one agent that came and was able then to replicate that spirit and give birth to many, many spirits of the chameleon. And the reason for that is to bring down church very fast, all right? That is what they do. And a chameleon, it takes one year to two years to mature, all right? So then that is another feature of the spirits, all right? So you are finding that agent in all the vital areas of the spiritual life of the church, all right, is in the intercession, is trusted there by the intercessors. And when they pray, they are so fake because they are fake, fake people, all right? When, when they pray, they pray prayers, they will throw themselves on the, on the ground and, 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 and scream and make noise and all that. And people will say that, oh, so-and-so, who is so filled by the Holy Spirit? Open your eyes. In 2022, the Lord says that I'm opening your eyes. And this message is intended to open your eyes. Really see the light. Not all of them who are making those crazy noises. And those ones are the ones that you will find that you are repelling this, this noise and this drama. All right, because this is an actor. They, 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 they are great pretenders, all right? They are double crossers. They, they are great actors, all right? They can act the, they can act the position, all right? So now they will do that, and when they are praying, they make prayers, and it's not in them. So we need to, to know these agents when they come to our churches, all right? So we need to be very careful. So in one year, one year, one year, the assignment of the chameleon agent might reach the maturity. And what is the maturity to shut down the house of the Lord? One year can reach that maturity. Or two years, it can reach the assignment and scatter all the sheep, all right? And you find yourself that you are starting again because of what? Of the chameleon spirit. In 2022, they must go away. Ever. They must get out of the house of the Lord in the mighty name of Jesus. And the other feature of the chameleon spirit, don't look for them. That is, the, this spirit can also enter children as well. The Satan can send the, 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 the young chameleon agents into the house of the Lord. As I said to you, that his plan in, is to attack children. The human sacrifices that are being done mostly right now are of children because Satan is demanding children. All right? So we need to be careful, you know, of what is happening and not to be oblivious. Of the, of the intentions of Satan during the end times, all right? So now, they, you, 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 you might find an agent, a chameleon agent in your children's ministry, all right? So I was, one time, I was doing a deliverance of a certain lady who was the agent of Satan, all right? She was actually the the bride of satan and what she said is that um, all of them in their family are born into witchcraft and i was like then she said that no there is no one in her family who's not a witch or a wizard all of them all right before they are formed in their mother's womb they are already dedicated to satan so by the time that they are they are born, they are already witches and the agents of Satan. That's what she said to me, all right? As toddlers, they are, they are being taught how to, how to use the powers of darkness, all right? They are trained then 
into witchcraft at an early age. So be careful then of the chameleon agent because they come in different sizes, in different age groups, all right? In different, they come with different assignments and so on. So is to attack the house of the Lord because chameleons attack branches. And in 2022, the chameleon spirit must fall down in Jesus' name. All right. Have you received anything? I believe so. Now I take this message. I seal it in the blood of Jesus Christ. And I pray that let it fall on the good soil so that it produces the intended fruits. Let the hearers of this word be covered with the powerful blood of Jesus Christ. This is the blood that makes us the overcomers against all the forces of darkness, including the chameleon spirits in the name of Jesus. And I cover also the doers of the word of the Lord in Jesus' name. And Lord God, I put the seal of the blood on this message in the mighty name of Jesus. Let the angels of the Lord be dispatched then to carry this message and deliver it where it is supposed to go to in the name of Jesus. This is apostle praise. And I am urging you to subscribe, to comment, and also to share the content of this channel. Be blessed, Apostle Praise. I'm signing off. See you in part three of this message.